A new report shows that memory loss due to dementia has two new risk factors, one related to your cholesterol levels, another your vision. I want to welcome our medical expert, Dr. David Winter, to discuss this. And uh, Dr. Winter, what have you learned about this new report? What stands out when you see it? Well, first, let me point out the dementia is a term that talks about the fact that your brain doesn't work as well as it should. You forget things. You can't concentrate well. You lose things. And a lot of things can cause that. Mark, Alzheimer's, probably the most common, multi infarct dementia, Pick's disease, Lewy body disease, some forms of Parkinson's, all those things are involved. But the one that causes the most problems with cholesterol is multi infarct dementia. That's when you have multiple strokes, a series of strokes, and that's from cholesterol plaques. So lowering the LDL, the bad cholesterol, is a good idea. Also, stimulation to the brain is important. And when people lose their vision due to glaucoma, cataracts, retinal detachments, retinal problems, that can also cause some problems with the brain. The brain needs stimulation, Mark. Well, that stimulation, I understand, though, can take a few different forms. It's not just the vision, like you mentioned. What other forms of stimulation have doctors said is worthwhile when it comes to dementia? Yeah, when people get hard of hearing, that could be a problem. So watch that. Get hearing aids if you need them. You can also make your brain better with stimulating it with mind games, crossword puzzles, Sudoku. Those can help. You also want to make sure that you have your brain in good shape with exercise, with eating well. A lot of things make a difference with stimulation, but that's important. We've learned keep the brain healthy. I've also seen, you know, just basic things like gardening, getting outdoors and kind of getting on your hands and knees and, and just staying active and busy can help as well. What are some other things that folks can do to kind of lower those chances of getting dementia? Yeah, we know concussions can cause a problem with the brain. Even milder, not a full concussion, but mild trauma to the brain can be a problem. So be careful with things that knock your head. Also, you want to be very careful with high blood pressure. High blood pressure is a problem. If you have hypertension, get it controlled. If you have diabetes, keep your blood uh, sugar controlled. That's very important also. So when it comes to dementia and memory loss, how much of those is the onset related to aging and how much are you still, you know, in the researching and uh, community trying to figure out? Yeah, this is important because dementia is not an aging phenomenon. I've got patients in their 80s and 90s and their brain is very, very sharp. Some of that's good luck. Some of it, they take good care of their brain. They ate well. They got plenty of sleep. They exercised and stimulated their brain. Think of your brain as a muscle. So with your muscle, if it gets weak, you make it strong by exercising, right? Stimulating your brain is one of those things that can also either prevent or delay the onset of dementia. Well, some great information uh, with that new research, Dr. David Winter. And I know there's a lot more that we don't know, but every little bit helps. Thank you for your time this Thursday. Thanks, Mark. Always good to be with you. Yeah.